Hi, hi friends. Welcome back to my channel, Testing Mini Bytes. I'm your friend Amazon Shaktivel, and today uh, this is not a technical topic. I want to make three important announcements uh, to all the you know Testing Mini Bytes family members, and uh, you know first among them uh, is you know I want to speak about. Um, the upcoming online training course where i will be teaching about uh, android automation using apm and you all know how important it is to learn about uh, mobile automation right so uh, there are a lot of jobs in the market that demands you to know apm right so that is very important core skill if you try to attend any interview they definitely going to ask you about apm because you know there are a lot of mobile apps that getting very very famous and it's it's become a mandate for all of us you know to test it thoroughly right as a testers right to automate them apm is one of the you know uh, tool that is widely used right wherever you go if you go for uh, you know website automation we have competitors we have selenium some people using webdriver i was some some use cypress some use protractor but you know in mobile app automation there are only couple of tools right so you have espresso as well as apm but apm is very very famous that's why you know if you have a very good knowledge about java and selenium it is very very easy to learn about apm the initial setup is very very tricky guys that's why you know if you are interested to learn apm okay i would suggest you to highly have a look at it, this particular course right so and um, and this course is starting on 15th june i'll come back to this announcement uh, in detail in the end of this video before that i'll try to cover these two announcement right so uh, since a lot of my videos right been uploaded into different uh, you know on topics uh, say selenium automation framework be it docker you know uh, be it as jet level framework or java it series right there are people who have doubts right when you are obviously trying it out yourself you have doubts i try to solve all those questions you know in a youtube comments but sometimes you know it becomes really tricky uh, to know without seeing the screenshots or something right that's why many of you have requested me personally to create a telegram group where they can share your questions or doubts right that's first thing and apart from that you also have a very good knowledge right if you are working as a tester you have a certain amount of knowledge you can mingle with other testers you can solve their doubts and then you can also make their life easy right first one if you have any doubts or clarification it's it's an open forum where you know you can join and then ask your questions and if you have if you if you have the capability to answer someone else's questions please feel free to do that right so it it it's a group where we also share knowledge um and then um, we also share about the job posting so if you're someone who is looking for a job this group might be even helpful for you right there is no charges involved in joining this group so it is always free please do join that if you are interested right good and the last one right so again guys i know you know i you know it's been just four months that i have started this channel and you know i got really really good support almost 2500 subscribers with with just four months is not it's not a simple task guys uh you know conducting just uh, testing related topics and getting this many subscribers is really really a uh, huge feat right if you are someone who is from a youtube uh, you know how hard it is right so i i got very good support from you people so if you feel that you are learning from this channel and you uh, you know you want to really contribute in some way right so i have uh, initiated a youtube membership program uh, very recently and this is one of the way where you can uh, give a token of appreciation for uh, you know my work uh, that you are learning something from my channel and uh, you know uh, it, it's it's just a way you are you know giving back to me um, right it is not mandatory guys again if you think you know you don't want to do that it's absolutely fine i'm going to do that continuously you know even if i get a membership or not but still if there is an option i try to explore it so you know so if you go to my youtube channel if you watch some videos from my channel okay there will be a button called join where you can go and then there are three levels uh, you know tiers that i have created one is uh, kilobytes one is megabytes and terabytes they cost just 29 rupees if you want to contribute uh, as less as 30 rupees per month that's absolutely fine you can do that as well you also can see the perks that you can get right you can see uh, the perks that you can get one out of your five lucky members can get uh, free access to my online training course guys so why i am doing this right it's not you know what i will get in, in you know you have to be a member for one year so imagine you are paying 30 rupees per month with just 360 rupees you are you are going to attend a, you know some kind of uh, online training course that cost 10000 rupees right so that is something that i am trying to give back to the community who wants you know i'm i'm not 
bothered about the money guys it's it's the relations between you and me right so i just want to build that you know i'm trying to find a better way to do this and i thought you know membership is one such way right so if you notice meha bites you get three out of five lucky members gets access to my course uh, online training course and other other uh, perks as well on the terabytes it's 160 almost 160 rupees per month it's very very less guys a, a biryani now cost 200 rupees right so it's very very less you know it's still not a mandate that you have to join but if you feel so please do join it and support me and everyone in the terabytes get free access to any of my online training course again if you already know rest assured you can join my apm course if if you already know about apm you can join my docker course so absolutely free right you can choose any one of the training but you have to be a member for one year right good so coming back to the original announcement about my apm course and this is the course that i want to cover in detail right i want to take about android automation using apm uh, specifically i am not covering ios guys because i don't want a mac now but if you know android automation it is just a little bit of extension to work with ios right so i am i am not going to you know tell that i am going to cover ios and do couple of scenarios no i am not going to do that i am just covering android automation but i i am going to cover it in detail so that you can work on ios as well right so you're going to get a very depth knowledge about android automation using apm and the starting date is 15th of june and i have a little bit of requirement from my side maybe you need to have a very good laptop or a desktop with good configuration yeah at least 4 gb of ram because if you want to spin up your emulators uh, you know it may take some memory but if you don't have that's also fine we will find some uh, use case from uh, you know we'll try to use uh, browser stack devices it it can give you one hour free or uh, we can use real devices for our testing but it's preferred at least you have a 4 gb of ram and 100 gb of free space otherwise i'll also tell you how we can use a aws rent and machine from aws if you don't have a particular uh, good configuration with you that's okay okay we'll do that and we'll also see uh, 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 you know we need at least the basic knowledge of java here why because i'm not going to cover what is a class what is an object in java what is constructor in java what is a method in java i'm not going to cover very basics of java here i'm going to dive deep into the advanced concepts like you know java eat or you know consumers suppliers how we can use them in test automation right all those advanced topics right we're going to use uh, as a j for our assertions you know we're going to dive deep into the you know uh, java topics uh, design patterns we're going to learn about the design patterns right so we're going to deal about all these things so it is not you know uh, uh, you know if you have uh, if you don't know basics of java maybe uh, you need to um, you know wait for my other course where i can start with uh, you know selenium uh, for java uh, selenium with java for beginners but this course you need to have at least the very basics about java not the in depth knowledge guy you don't know need to know about multi threading you know all those things very basics right what is constructor what is method what is class what is object right that is enough again if you have a knowledge on selenium that's okay thumbs up if not no problem we can cover it again obviously if you need to have a good knowledge about testing because that's when you know about the flows right uh, yeah but again we can we can cover it that's not a big deal but basics of java is is kind of a mandate here right and then you need to have a unquenching thirst to learn right because apm is kind of very very tricky guys to to do the initial setup you may face lot of issues so it, it is very very common that people try to do the setup for apm and then they run away from apm so that that can happen so you need to have a unquenching thirst to learn it so i will be there to help you anyways but you know this is the high level topics that we're going to cover we're going to cover android automation of your native apps web apps and also try to cover some hybrid apps if i find one but yeah i am not going to cover ios in this but we will develop a framework in such a way that it can also support ios right but you are not going to cover ios here and we are going to deal more about the android sdk and its components the program programming language that we are going to use is java we're going to use testng as our unit testing framework we also try to incorporate certain uh, design patterns like uh, stack factory singleton builder patterns wherever it is applicable and we'll also use assertj for uh, you know writing fluid assertions instead of our normal assertj uh, test engine assets and we'll also use a build tool as maven and we're going to create a very good report using excellent reports right and the cost of this course is 8500 rupees guys if you can pay it in installments it's two installment that's absolutely fine i'm not going to bother about it and if you are someone who have lost your job because of covid or any other reasons you can pay 1000 rupees for 
for the course right 8000 rupees you, you get a 7500 rupees discount um i have given this for free previously right in my previous course i have given it for free but when i give it for free people think you know i am teaching something uh, uh, you know they are not attending the course very properly so it is not going to the right people so that's why i want to set up a minimum limit that you need to pay 1000 rupees right it's not about the cost guys it's about uh, you paying your attention to you know do the learning right you are you are occupying someone else space but you need to be uh, you know uh, very cautious about learning right and the timing is from tuesday wednesday friday and saturday i give, give a gap in between on thursday so that you can practice and then you can ask me doubts on uh, uh, thursday or you know sunday right and monday obviously will be busy so i'm not taking anything on monday right so it it will be around 20 to 30 hours spanning over one and a half months and you will get your uh, video recordings and if you have any issues i'll be there to solve over a zoom call on thursday and sunday maximum participants is 25 guys i am going to restrict it to 25 because i can only cater 25 students because the problem is if i if i enroll 100 or 50 right the problem is you know i cannot serve them individually they won't learn out of it out of my course i don't want to do that again guys i have given all these things in detail you can go through them again um, i'm going to cover all this parallel execution how we can work with uh, cloud providers you know all the we want to use data provider with json sena of uh, using excel we will also use with excel but i'll also tell you how we can use data provider with json all those uh, you know advanced concepts you can go through this here right i don't want to go in deep into that and also try to use design patterns as a j library and then how we can extend the framework to ios automation guys framework is very very important you going to develop everything from the scratch again if you have any specific requirements or problem statements if you have and then we will try to you know adapt that and try to cover it in our uh, class as well again guys very very important if you want to withdraw at any point of time okay uh, you are you are you're, you're nobody going to stop you if if you have not learned anything after attending all my classes then absolutely no fine your your money will be refunded right i don't want money uh, if you are not learning anything from my course right so why i am doing this because i am very very confident that you you know i can train people very well so that you know they tend to learn apm very well right so i have that confidence with me and that's the only reason i am telling your money will be refunded fully without any questions guys okay don't worry about your money that you are paying okay there is no demo sessions nothing like that all your sessions are demo session okay so uh, yeah so if you have any questions please write it to me i i will attach my uh, telegram group link or your uh, you know everything in the in the video description okay, if you have any doubts please feel free to ask to me right again that's it guys that's all from my side if you if you feel any any questions please write reach out to me bye until then tata bye bye from more than i'll see you all in another great video tata bye bye